do indeed, and it's on the hunt. It's looking in all the little holes of the marulas here in quarantine and looking for squirrels and birds that could potentially be here. And I'm surprised it's going unnoticed because there's a few hornbills around and they generally give these African harrier hawks a very hard time. It's not a bird that steals a lot of the young ones, so unfortunately for it, it gets chased around quite a bit. And the drongos also always are having a go. But isn't it a beautiful bird? It's got those beautiful gray wings. And there we go. You see how it hops from sort of branch to branch with those long legs that it walks with? And then it will stick those long legs into holes sometimes and grab, like I say, squirrel babies and young birds and even lizards and pull them out. So it's not a very well liked bird in this area. They are very pretty. And you can see its face is just coming out of breeding. So when they're in the breeding phase, they'll have a very red face. Otherwise, the face is normally a yellow color. So it's just coming out of its breeding back towards its normal coloration. Now, you can actually see some of the drops of water on its back there from the tree as it's been jumping around. And there it goes. Well, that was a nice surprise. I don't know, there it is, it's still in the tree, Craig. It's just gone further up. I thought it had flown away, but it was somewhere there. There we go. And you can hear the bird's alarm calling at it now. I wonder if it's going to start getting dive-bombed. They like the marula trees because marula trees often have big holes in them. And like I say, squirrels use them a lot, and so there's often a lot of opportunity to find food in amongst these. So you'll find them going from tree to tree as they go, which is pretty cool. Now those, I wonder if that's water or if it's just spots on the wing itself. No, it is water, is it? Looks like it. And there we go. And off it flies to, to the next marula tree. So there we go, landed in that one. So now I'm going to try to see if it can't find food. I think let's try to see if we can't reposition, Craig. Maybe we can see if it finds something. I'm just going to probably have to go round a little bit so that you can actually see. Uh, because, oh, no, I don't know if you're going to be able to see, Craig, or if it's going to fly away, if it's even worth this. But there it is. You can see it's just straight through there. So on the marula in the background, on the, tr no, to the left. Uh, there, there, top left. Up, 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 up a little bit, to the left a bit more. In amongst that vegetation now. It was hopping around in there. No, I think it might have gone. I can't see it now. It was bouncing around in that thicket. So, I, unfortunately, we've lost visual of our Harrier Hawk. Oh well, it was still nice to see and we got a really good display from it.